G'day guys, Steve here from Tackle Addiction. Um, just out here on the Lanco River this morning. Freaking cold, woke up this morning, it was ice all over the car. So we had a mad frost overnight. Um, yeah, I thought I'd come down here, fish all these holes on a run up. I know it's an ideal tide, but uh, who cares, better than sitting alone. So, I'll rig up. <coughs> Got the one to three black mamba TT rods, um, the Kuma ITX 2500, and a fresh spool of Tasline 8 pound, which I'm loving at the moment. Got a 130 second hidden weight, and on that, I'm going to put a Pro Lua paddle grub in 65 mil, which is the chartreuse shrimp, one of my favorite colors. having a lot of success on these grubs lately. Being winter and freezing cold, I'm just gonna stick to the old plastics today and fish them really, really slow. These are the Atomic um, Seekers in the hidden weight. They hold the plastic on really, really well, I find, so. The reason I'm using the hidden weight mainly is because I don't want any noise when I'm hitting the side of the holes. Spooking any fish. Give a bit of accent on that. Even the, even the scent's gone hard. It's <laughs> that cold. pound Yamatoyo this morning as a leader material which I think should be heaps around here now yeah, which boat heaps of boats in this bay nice and quiet no wind the sun's coming up why would you be sitting at home on a Saturday morning? Alright. Call that a brim. <laughs> Straight in the corner of the jaw, where we want it. I'm going to do is I'm going to get my Procure scent out. That sack scent was quite hard. That's a very waxy type of scent. The Procure is much more oil based with natural sort of ingredients in it. Somewhere down here. There it is. It's good to have a couple of different sense you know um look i mean they all work as far as i'm concerned but the procure is does have you know if it says bloodworm it's actually got bloodworm in it i don't know what the other ones have got in them but you can see it's more oily oily based scent compared to a a wax style scent 
boat again now we've got some new fresh scent on there being winter I just slow everything right down I've just even let the plastic sit there in their face if you have to they're not as uh, aggressive in the winter months you know, I like to sulk under structure and sometimes just letting the bait sit there and annoying them will trigger the strike so there's no excuses summer, winter, spring get out there a lot of people don't like to fish in winter but you know what there's no one on the water look at the, look at the day it's perfect See that hidden weight's doing the job. Slowly sinking down the water column. See about 26, 27, I don't know. And a lot of the times, if there's one, you'll get another one out of the same hole. He hit that on the drop as it was sinking slowly, just took it and swam off with it, which is the way you want them to go. So that was sinking now it has just stopped so what are we in 2.7 meters of water a lot of times that when you're seeing your line just stop and you know it hasn't hit the bottom bigger definitely oh, no. a small one I think oh, flooded
back my saw fish straight into the lip Just when you least expect it. Okay. On the paddle tail, 65mm throw little paddle tail grub. 